Hey everyone, welcome to Grotech Stuff and today we'll be checking out how to completely wipe your Windows phone. Last week we had checked out how to completely wipe your Android phone and this time we have a Windows phone around. So this is the no not Nokia, this is the Microsoft Lumia 640 running Windows Phone 8.1 and we'll be checking out how to completely wipe it. So the first thing you need to do is click on your press your power button, slide down and power off your phone because that's important. And once it's off, the next thing you need to do is just opening the back cover of your phone. We are going to do this because we need to remove your SIM cards and the memory card so that it can't be accessed by the next owner of the device. So I'm hiding the IEI number of the phone for privacy reasons. Let me just remove the battery first so that we can remove the SIM later the battery comes out easily just like that oh no yeah yeah it's out I actually like the build quality of this phone I don't know why I'm giving it up but anyway so we have two sims here let me just take them out sim 1 let's push it out actually let's pull it out not push it so it's out Next we have another one. Let me just pull that out as well. And but not the least, we need to remove the micro SD card also because it can contain your photos, videos and other documents which you may not prefer to share with your next owner of the device. So that's out of the way as well. So after removing all this, put your battery back in and power up the phone. So it may take a few it's not few minutes few moments to boot up we get your Microsoft logo and we'll have the um, Windows logo and finally the phone will get booted up and once it's booted up just go into settings hold down and once you're down click on about and in about you just need to select reset your phone so once you select that yeah you need to confirm that because all your files are getting deleted be sure to back up everything before you delete because you can't recover them easily so yes I'm ready to destroy everything on my phone yes yes yeah goodbye so the phone starts resetting now takes a few moments to boot up then you get the usual Microsoft logo and then you have these gears they're turning to show that the phone is getting formatted and it just starts progressing it may take a few minutes for this process to complete because all the files need to get deleted and once that's done you get the Microsoft and Windows logos again and once both of those are out of the way we next have we need to set the phone yeah so it back to the phone as it did when it when you first brought the phone so need to configure everything do remember here don't give in your Wi-Fi details don't put in your sim card don't specify any details keep going just remove all the text so that no information is collected from the phone I know it doesn't have a data connection but still just untick everything can go with recommended I'll choose custom just remove all the ticks because we don't need all of that now we're just selling the phone away so we remove all the tips I mean ticks and if it asks for any personal information we just don't give it we just keep those options I don't want to sign in skip sign in so skip signing and it will take some time to install and configure all the apps it may take a few minutes just leave it to do that and once that's done just click on close and next so after all those options are gone we come back to the 
start screen yes this is how your phone will look when you first bought it so now it's completely cleared of everything now what you will need to do is yeah close all the notifications we don't need them so now what you're gonna need to do is take the USB cable which connects to your computer and connect your phone to the computer and what you need to do is dump some old useless files into the phone and fill the memory so that the memory is filled with some junk files and then what you need to do is go into settings again go to about again and we need to reset the phone again so why we are doing this is the sole reason is that the old files which are accumulated in the phone don't actually get fully deleted when you reset the phone so by dumping some jump files inside your phone all the old files will get replaced so there will be no record of your old important files that's why we are doing this keep repeating this process of dumping some files into your phone and then resetting it again a few times maybe two or three times and then the work will be completely done and before you are giving your phone for exchange you have to give the original charger and the earphones if they were provided because sometimes uh, the if you are exchanging through an e-commerce website they say they don't need the box and the accessories but the person comes to collect the phone they do ask for those so remember to find your accessories and most importantly also do keep the box because they may ask for that just pack everything inside the box and keep it ready for use not ready for use ready to sell so that was a quick guide on how to reset your windows phone thanks for watching and do stay tuned for more thank you